Hi everyone, it's Red T, and as you know, I did a little announcement for a Q&A video because it's been more than a year that I done one. So why not doing another one just for fun, you know? It's funny. Some people ask me some questions and thank you for everyone who asked questions and thank you for everyone who watched the video too. Thank you everyone anyway. So I really hope you will enjoy the video. If you do, you can subscribe, it's totally free. You can change your mind later. You know what else is totally free? Clicking on the bell button, commenting the video, like the video. <laughs> I'm totally not forcing you. You can also follow my Twitch and uh, my TikTok, my Instagram, everything, my Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. But anyway, let's start the video. Enjoy. The first question is asked by Water Texas, which is called I am the Alpha on VRChat. You saw him on my little murder video. Like hey, Rossi, you're a nice streamer. I like <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> so he's asking for QA. Yeah, that's a QA. Good job. Repti, would you love to give me your beans and let me boop them every time I am on with you? Okay, I mean, I don't, I don't mind. I don't mind. I give the beans to whoever want to get the beans and I don't have thought of touch. So, <laughs> I won't be tickled by that. Next question is asked by Tosino, I think. It's how I pronounce it. I really hope I'm not making any mistake. If I do, I'm really sorry for anybody I destroy the name. So their first question is, do you play any PS1 games? If so, favorite game? I used to play PS1 when I was a kid. I'm 23 years old, so I kinda was born middle of PS1. But I was playing Spyro 1, uh, Guilty Gears. I remember playing it with my sister and we would take the big guy and we would just do that and we were like, oh my god, <laughs> he's dancing. Anything can make us laugh. Anything can make us... Anything can make us laugh when we are chilled. Anything... Anything can make us laugh when we are children. There was also the Tarzan game. Uh, what there's? I think that's all? Maybe there was other, but I don't remember. But yeah, I haven't played any PS1 game in a while, except for the Spyro, but the, the newer version. So yeah, I would say Spyro for my favorite, because Spyro. The second question, what animation style do you find the second most aesthetically pleasing? What do you mean, like, not saying the one I found the most, but just the second one? Because the, the first one will be, in a way, like, for sure, 2D because it's drawing, you know, it takes time, it takes a lot of work, and that's what I do, so I really, really like it. I'm not saying other oh, don't take a lot of work. <laughs> I'm just, this kind of animation style, I can speak out of experience, so I know it takes a lot of work. 3D I would be my second most favorite then, because I really love it, it's really nice. Next question, asked by Guru Shikuto. Will you ever live stream here? Uh, I don't think because the chat in YouTube is really bad. There is a lot of problem with streaming on YouTube, so streaming on Twitch is way better. So, next question. Do you know the Jack and Dexter game series? I know it from name, but I've never played it. Next question by Sandog. So, the first question is favorite anime. My favorite anime, I would say, is... I can't... I can't really decide. I have three of them. I can say my three favorite enemies. So there is Fairy Tale, there is Assassination Classroom, because oh my god, that is so good. And there is Vinland Saga. So this is my top three. Rate Fairy Tale 1 to 10, 9. It's incredible. I love the anime. What I hate is the it's the arc with the key and like the doll that comes back to the sea. I really hate this arc. It's a filler arc anyway. All the filler arc, I feel like they are bad. Also, all the boobs like yuck. I don't want to see boobs. I don't mind with seeing Grey totally naked, but I don't want to see Leslie naked. I'm way too gay for that. And last question, what OC is your fave that a friend own? I actually don't know. I'm just gonna pass this question because I really don't know what to answer. Next question by Audio. Hi Audio. Wanna snuggle? My arms are always open. If you want to snuggle, Audio, of course. But you will have to admit that you're cute. Next question by Captain Minus. Yeah, I still don't know how to pronounce that. I'm really sorry, Captain. If you could build it, what is your dream house? Kind of hard to say. Like a house with walls. Uh, 
an office for me to work. A second office, maybe, for someone else. If I have a boyfriend, but no, I don't have one. <laughs> and I guess a nice big room, then a nice living room. I don't really know what else to say. Oh, yeah. Something I really want for my house is a big bathtub. Because, oh my god, I hate going to bathtub. And it's like not really big. So either you, your whole torso is outside, even sometimes the belly, or your legs are outside the water, which is really not good. <laughs> I want a big bathtub to be able to enter my entire body in it. And maybe someone else's body. Next question from Captain. Would you rather have a complete collection of all manga you've read or access to every game from one video game platform? From one video game platform? You mean like Steam or something like that? Oh, like having all the game on Steam? Okay, I would choose that then. If it's if if if, if I'm big brain and not small brain, <laughs> I understood what what was the question. If I would uh, if I could access every game for free on Steam, yeah, of course I would choose that. What is your favorite vacation memory? Who? Yeah, I don't. <laughs> I don't really have a favorite vacation memory. Last question from Captain. What is your favorite food or meal you've had? I would say a lot because I like to eat. <laughs> The thing is, some of them, I don't know how to say it in English. I don't even know if people that aren't from France know it anyway. <laughs> but I can say something else then. Sushi, of course. Burgers. Uh, pizza. Of course, I love that. And of course, some French food. Because French is so good in making food. So, next person who asked me a question is Doctor Doctor. Okay. Why do you think you exist? This is quite an easy answer. So the reason I exist is because my father f my mother. But okay, let's answer it seriously. Why do I think I exist? I want to make people happy. So maybe, maybe my reason to exist is to drift. My reason to exist is to drift. Next question by Berber. What is your favorite game to play? Ooh, uh, so I love playing Assassin's Creed. It's one, gameplay wise, it's one of my favorite game. I used to love Far Cry, uh, COD. I used to love Rainbow Six, but now it became shit. Thanks Ubisoft for that. And of course, VR chat. I mean, come on, come on. Look at that, especially with full body tracking. I need to fix my legging, I know. Next one is JC. My friend JC was already here for the first Q&A. The question he asked in the first Q&A was very nice. Here, he wants to make drama. Huh, JC, you want to make drama? Huh? By asking me, am I your favorite? Am I your favorite, are you say You are my favorite squeaker. Aha. Uh -huh. Next question from Rex. Why are you a gay bottom? Why are you calling bottom? I am gay, but not a bottom. I am a switch. I can take it or I can give it. I hope the movement was really enjoyable for you guys. <laughs> Again, another question from Rex. What is the one moment that made you say, this is who I want to be when I became a furry? And the third question from Rex. Why are you a cute gay furry baguette? It's true, I am a gay furry baguette. But you are cute. You're like cute anyway. Me? No. No, no, no. Okay, next question from Brian. So question one, which I don't understand because there is only one question anyway. <laughs> I think you, you forgot to ask a second question. I don't know. Did you watch Creepypasta as a kid? If so, what was your favorite? Yours is Smile. Chipek. Okay, I don't know this one. Not really because I was extremely scared. I know mostly about Levenville from Pokemon. Then there was... Um, Obviously Slender, Slenderman, and Jeff the Killer. I would say then the Levenville Creepypasta. Next question by Sally. What got you into VR? Furry! <laughs> I mean, come on, VR chat. I used to play VR chat by, back in 2018. When I was on desktop, I wasn't a furry back then, so I was playing as a Neko girl. I'm disgusted by myself, by the way, don't worry. I played for two months, I had a lot of fun with my friend and everything, we were playing murder and doing some shit. Stopped for two years until my friend Soko say, Come on via chat! I was like, oh, okay, okay, guys, so I can join. I joined him, and it was funny and everything, I talked with people, and, and then I was like, oh my god, I want a headset. 
So I did commissions, commission and commission until I had enough. Then I was like, huh, with that money, I could buy a new graphic tablet because even today I still have my first graphic tablet, which has four years, five years. And it was like, no, you buy Quest 2. They were like, yeah, but if I play only like once, once a month to be a chat, it will be a, loss, a waste of money. It was like, no, you're going to stay every day in VR chat. Go buy it. So I bought it. And look at me now. I'm a VR chat thought. I am a VR chat thought. Look at me. I can't stop moving my hips when I'm playing VR chat now. I can't stop being gay. The, the temptation is way too strong. So the last question asked by Dustin Yoda, which I know who it is. I know what is your secret identity, Dustin. What all you got planned for the new year? Literally nothing. What incredible shenanigan will you be getting up to? Oh, a lot of shenanigans. You have no ID. Oh, well. And of course, am I your favorite? F you. Lovingly, of course. Y'all are my favorite in the f***ing group. So don't worry, I love you, you big, cuddly, weak beast. Anyway, like I said, it was the last question. I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe. Like I said at the start of the video, follow my socials. So yeah, thank you for everyone who asked a question. Thank you for everyone who watched the video. Thank you for everyone who subscribed. Thank you for everyone. Anyway, I hope you're gonna have a wonderful day, a wonderful night, a wonderful everything because you, adorable being, deserve it. You're probably wondering why. Well, that's because it's simple. You are cute. And I took away you with a scat privilege, I so surrender to the baguette. You don't have a choice. So, bye bye. See you on next video. On next stream. Bye. Mwah.